This question eight, it's all about the experiment on the electrostatics. It's, a, it's the relationship between the force and the charge. In the description box, so all my links for other questions on Pendulilo for this question paper, as well as a, a link to another channel for our lessons. I would appreciate it now we are subscribers to that channel as well. This channel, Lena, it's only dedicated to Ama question papers. Check the other channel out. Now, question eight. An experiment is conducted to investigate the relationship between the force experienced by a charge if the electric field strength is kept constant. Electric field strength is kept constant. The table of results is given below. So, sino force. The force is the y values. It's the set of y values. It's the domain. The x axis are my charges. The domain for this function is in my charges la ugly table. The following graph is obtained. So it's force versus charge. It looks it, it is a straight line. It is a straight line. 8.1 define the electric field at a point. So this is the definition. Electric field at a point is the electrostatic force experienced per unit of positive charge placed at that point, right? This is a charge. Around the charge, we get a electric field. The electric field strength at this point and the electric field strength at this point. Point number one, point number two. Go point number one, the electric field is strong. Go point number two, you weak. The closer you are to the charge, the greater the strength. The further you move away from the charge, the weaker the electric field strength. Right? So the electric field, it varies from point to point from point to point right from point to point so this is the definition 8.2 give the relationship between the force and the charge that this is keep directly proportional directly proportional they are directly proportional I'm feeling shagamarech directly proportional. Directly proportional. There, there's a direct proportion. The straight line you pass through the origin. So this is direct proportional. If we charge we increase, uh, the force increase. If charge we increase again, the force increases. That's direct proportion. Well, direct proportion, inverse proportion, the relationship between it ama ama data sets. So I studied last year when we were doing ama, ama guesses, ideal guesses. Abu Pascal's law, Abu Charles' law, the time you see discuss a law, the way cha ama graphs were, were discussing Abu pressure, Abu volume, the relationships. Nagu, what's this topic? Universal gravitation. Newton's, Newton's universal law of gravitation there was something about inverse and direct proportion even now electrostatics there is a relationship between charge and force distance between charges and force you need to know this stuff so that's kuluma direct proportion see kuluma something like this inverse proportion it's something like a hyperbolic function it's something like a hyperbolic function 8.3 8.3.1 Use the information above and calculate the gradient of the graph. Calculate the gradient of the graph. No, 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 Logo, I'm banu zufundela ko. Namang yam shy, yam trapa. 
Use the information above and calculate the gradient. All right, let us calculate. For no calculate the gradient. I shall go match it. The gradient is equal to change in y divided by the change in x. It's y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. Analytical geometry. It's up to you. Good thing is point 0.1. I mean point 0.2 this point. Point 0.1 this point. Or this one and this. It's up to you. It's up to you. You need to choose two points. So, now we point 0.2 one and point 0.1 one. Y2, 0, 0.05 minus Y1, 0, 0.05. Two five divided by x. Now be careful. Now about there's a times. This is a charge. This is there's a times ten to exponent minus nine nano. Right? It's a nano charge. So x two seven comma six times ten to exponent nine minus lanite thirty eight thirty eight three eight. 38 times 10 to exponent minus 9. Answer. Answer. Calculate. Right. As we now see, as this this is cover. Now, now you busy of filling is cut so cool. Hmm. You need to have a gun. You need king I have. We have one young barasala. Oh, okay, calculator, fell a foot. All right, now you answer it to you guys. It's six million five hundred seventy eight nine four seven point three seven. Why pal I saw? Why pal I saw? I see in fact. Six five seven eight nine four seven four seven four seven comma three seven three seven three seven nine answer it. What are the units? Okay, before you pal, what are the units for for this gradient? This okay, it's a gradient. I know who means we don't have our units whenever I calculate a gradient, but now we need to have our units. This gradient is representing any ama units. The y it's the force, the x is the charge. What are the units for these for this gradient? It's newton per charge the gradient represents e electric field strength and there is over constant is over constant it remains constant is all about in is all about in this is the controlled variable electric field strength is kept constant where do tata the point lay you told her the same answer because of e electric field strength is kept constant Calculate the value of x, get much. 8.3.2. Mets, 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 Kukali Mets, wire, wire, the question. All right. X now. So, if you this point, na any other point, all for now. So, you can see the value of gradient to calculate the unknown value right oh no i say oh yeah 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 man yeah 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 something just dawned on me man. e is equal to force over charge yeah this formula has seven the electric field strength is also calculated as force divided by charge so signs are so or maybe we are seven cents. Maybe it's not. It's not explore and only on to level as well. So the charge is calculated as. You know what? I need to find the number now. So. No, no, no. Young stress. Young frustrator, man. Young frustrator, let's go. 
Sinasebe nisi scientific notation. Nanga wa wea scientific notation. It's fine. Yege li soe answer ku seven zena. Is this is right? Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Six, comma, five, eight. Ngususa le comma le. Let's comma it. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ni letter la. So that it is. Ibe. So what is the comma ya ngususa? Up until before the last digit. Oh no. Up until before. Up until okay. Up until after the first digit, we begala. Yeah, one after all six. Basically, I'm moving it at in two decimal places. So I'm rounding off like five, bunny five eight. So since I'm moving it one, two, three, four, five, six, the comma, le, is what it x. I mean, is what it times ten to exponent bunny six la nano coulomb. Yeah, one. This is scientific notation. Nangabu muvela to the left, your exponent iba positive. If we muvela to the left, if it's in muvela comma one, two, three, four, five, six to the right, I mean, to the yeah, to the right, I mean, is about negative la, ne? But unga unga war too much na I'm avoiding lento leok palis number is name la five seven eight nine four three no no. Use of scientific notation. Me gentleman, pela me. Six comma five eight times ten to exponent six is equal to sifunau f x. We have one sifunau f x lapa divided by what is the charge? The charge ubani sixty three comma eight sixty three comma eight times ten nanocula nine. Then we cross multiply one would do fx is equal to is equal to uh, six comma five eight times ten to exponent six multiplied by six comma three eight times ten to exponent minus nine equal to <coughs> equal to so our answer la Uh, it's on much. Okay. Hey, 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 hey. I want to calculate. What want to do, I want to do Eight, two decimal places. Hey, calculator, man. Yes. Two decimal places is zero comma four. Two newtons. I think we'll go round that off. I'm sure I'm busy, so well. Son. All right. Now, 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 now. When I seven see meds, when I seven see images, you can use the gradient here for again. But this time we seven see using u y two minus y one over x two minus x one equal to gradient, right? Y two, let's say two lona one, right? Let's say we have zero comma three five minus y one x divided by x two five three comma two times ten minus times ten exponent minus nine minus we have we have forty forty sixty three comma eight times ten to exponent minus nine. Equal to the gradient, yeah. Then you solve for x. Nanga buzi sayi lenge met shona ko namgana shona ko shona ko shona ko. The lifestyle, the. It should be image axis subject. The lifestyle, the guys, the guys. Eight point four. Eight point four. Sketch the electric field pattern around the charge if it had been a negative charge. If it had been a negative charge, another free mark, man. Free mark, Jimmy. Ne? Free mark. Nga pais, nga pais im ganam, nga pais, nga pais. Intes ngan elvis. Nai. 
a negative charge the electric field lines are moving towards for a positive charge they are moving away all right now question eight way to guys i hope you enjoy it i hope you enjoy some value out of this video uh in the description box there's a link to another channel as well as links to other questions in my for this question paper so for now bye 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 but now Nangabe Ufuna Amanya Amalogans Amanya Ma Let me say Uzong Tola Nikulu Magwenyi lesson Nangabe we are clicker one of the links below. So for now, peace out guys.